Now moving on to the psychiatry part. A 30 year old patient presents to the clinic two weeks after witnessing sudden death of his father. There are symptoms of nightmares, flashbacks and hypervigilance. These symptoms cause significant distress and have been present for two weeks. Which of the following is the most appropriate diagnosis? The options were PTSD, acute stress disorder, adjustment disorder and option D generalized anxiety disorder and the correct answer for the same is option B acute stress disorder. The next question is Mr. K is described by his friends as being rigid, overly focused on rules and order and a perfectionist. He often submits his work late because he insists on making it perfect and believes strongly in morality. Which of the following is the most likely personality disorder and has been like taught by Dr. Praveen in his psychiatry mission class videos the exact same lines were there and the answer for the same is option A obsessive compulsive personality disorder. The next question is a 35 year old man is found wandering in another city by a social worker. He appears confused about his identity and cannot recall how he reached there. There are no signs of intoxication or head injury and medical evaluation is normal. He is unable to provide personal information and seems to have a sudden unexpected travel away from home. The likely diagnosis was asked and the correct answer is option B, dissociative refuge. The next question, a young man presents to the psychiatry OPD reporting that when he sits down, he hears birds flapping their wings. He believes it is a sign from God directing him to move in a specific direction. Which the following psychopathology is present. The options were A, sudden delusional idea, option B, delusional perception, option C, paranoid delusion and option D, thought insertion. And the correct answer for the same is option B, delusional perception. The next question, a schizophrenia patient on haloperidol was responding well for last two years. Now he presents with orofacial dyskinesia, choreoform movements and possible dystonia. The probable diagnosis and treatment was asked. The diagnosis was tardive dyskinesia and treatment was well balanced.